welcome back to the new video in this video i show you how you can reset your latest mac os monterey on non m1 chip macbook the apple silicon macbook uh, resetting system is different so uh, if you if you are m1 user or m1 pro user so you just open the settings and after settings you click this system preference and here you can show it is all content option so click there and it is easily but the old macbook user like uh, 2013 to 2020 uh, 2020 uh, all the macbook user you have to reset or erase everything manually the old method so in this video i show you how you uh, reset the mac os monterey uh, uh, old method so the method is very simple so uh, just follow me open the system preference again and uh, sign out your apple account if it login so my account uh, i already log out from here so you must log out it from there and uh, if you have anything important so just backup it first because everything will be removed so we have to turn off the macbook but my battery is very low 39 percent so for this situation i recommend uh, input your charger and then start the process otherwise it have uh, a chance to just break or destroy the system so connect the charger and then start uh, i turn off the mac first shut down i say again this is no uh, this is for non m1 chip uh, macbook and macbook pro all right so after turn off the macbook now you press the command button from your uh, keypad command plus r command plus r then you uh, three second press this power button one two three and then release but still uh, press this command and r option so after some time you see the recovery option it's very easy so don't be panicked the process is very simple all the macbook macbook air and macbook pro is same without apple silicon device so that you can reset and it is everything now you can release no problem okay so here you see the uh, recovery menu and first we have to go the disk utility to delete the partition so uh, this is my uh, partition there i installed the mac os and other partition is for boot camp there i install windows so i don't uh, erase this partition so i just delete only this my name uh, there it's it's total 149 GB so I erase it click this erase button and the default it format the default it choose APFS format and this is the legal format uh, you just click this erase button now okay our erase is complete now just click this uh, close icon and now you reinstall the mac os monterey so click this continue option okay now continue and
agree agree and now you choose this first one the first one partition okay now we start the process so it's depend on your internet connection how first so maybe for my internet speed uh, take three or four hours to complete installing and after install complete i see you the next process to set up so until you just wait and uh, you do yourself